the Department of Pathology at Weill Cornell is just a great place to work. Great training in both anatomic and clinical pathology. It's an outstanding program to do translational research. The facilities are new, they're modern, they're fantastic. Exceptional teachers. We have an entire floor dedicated to pathology. Expert faculty, research support, specimen diversity, they're all here. It's just a great place to train. I am chairman of the Department of Pathology and Laboratory Medicine at the Weill Cornell Medical College. I also serve as pathologist in chief of the New York Presbyterian Hospital Weill Cornell campus. The Weill Cornell Medical College is a small but very prestigious medical school located on the Upper East Side of Manhattan. The New York Presbyterian Hospital is the result of a merger of our affiliated hospital, New York Hospital and the affiliated hospital for Columbia University, which at that time was called Presbyterian Hospital. The medical college has undergone phenomenal growth during the past decade. The Department of Pathology has also seen phenomenal growth. We have outstanding faculty. We have brand new facilities. As a result, this department is now among the leading departments in the United States. I am the director of the residency training program at the Weill Cornell Medical College in New York Presbyterian Hospital. I am also chief of breast pathology and director of the breast pathology fellowship program. Most of our residents decide to pursue an academic career and our program is uniquely structured to make that happen. First, we have a unique infrastructure that allows for many research opportunities among our residents and faculty. Secondly, we have a fully subspecialized sign-out service, which allows for focused interest to develop early. Lastly, we offer a wide range of fellowship programs, which many of our residents take advantage of. My name is Kevin Turner. I'm a third-year resident. I'm interested in genital urinary pathology. One of the reasons that I chose Cornell is the residents that are here. As I interviewed, I found the residents uh, were very knowledgeable, very competent, very confident and I was also impressed by their involvement in research. Many of the residents here participate in uh, research projects and essentially I wanted to become part of this group. One good aspect of this program is the flexibility in scheduling. The program is able to tailor your schedule to accommodate any interest that you might have. For example, I had an interest in genital urinary pathology and as a third year resident, I was able to have a dedicated block of three months uh, in which to participate in a variety of GE research projects. My name is Rachel Kaplan and I'm a fourth year uh, anatomic and clinical pathology resident. I have chosen breast pathology as my uh, chosen fellowship and I did so because I have a strong interest in women's health and I feel connected to the patient population as well as the surgeons. An advantage of our program is that we have protective preview time. So every day after we gross a specimen, we look at those slides we come up with a diagnosis, we write it down, and we are able to read on it before we assign it out with the attending next day. The attending is an expert in the field and will give us feedback on what we've written and how we can do it better the next time. I'm Brian Robinson. I'm an attending pathologist and former resident here at Weill Cornell. I think that Cornell really prepared me to be an academic pathologist. My subspecialty interest is genital urinary pathology. I was able to go away for fellowship for training. Cornell really gave me the tools I needed to succeed in another environment. At the time, Cornell did not have a fellowship that I was interested in. Now we have a GU fellowship as well as many others to offer, which I think is a, a great opportunity for residents here who get to know the program well um, and want to have expertise and be able to stay on for fellowship training. One of the great things about Cornell residency is the resources the department offers for performing research and developing an academic career. As a resident, I was involved in multiple research projects that led to a variety of publications. And now, as a faculty member, I'm really honored to be able to provide back to the residents the same sort of fostering and mentorship that I received as a resident. The Surgical Pathology Service is located on the 10th floor of the Star Building. This is where all the specimens come for accessioning, processing, handling, frozen section, everything that we do with an anatomic pathology specimen. All of the space is new. Every square inch, the accessioning area, the gross room, the histology lab, the transcription area, the residence room, everything is brand new, developed over the last few years. Every resident has their own workspace. You have your own computer just for your use. 
All of our medical records are online, so it's easy to look up patient information. This means state-of-the-art computers for faculty and for the house staff, state-of-the-art video projection system for conferences and for educational purposes. My role in the Department of Pathology is to lead translational research efforts. We are developing platforms that will allow us to take clinical observations and move them into the research setting. Working in the laboratory and getting involved in a project is extremely exciting for residents. They can take an observation that they made while looking under the microscope and move it into laboratory and try to dissect it and understand the biology. The goal would be to then take that observation that they made and bring it into some clinical setting where they can develop a new test or assay to figure out why patients will do better or worse. We're focusing on prostate cancer, but there are many other researchers in the department looking at hematologic diseases as well as uh, other solid tumors. One of the exciting aspects of being here at Cornell is that we're able to not only work at this institution, but also collaborate closely with people at Memorial Sloan Kettering across the street and Rockefeller Institute. I'm Kate Piatti. I'm the chief resident, and I'm a fourth year resident training in both anatomic and clinical pathology. We have 22 residents here at Wall Cornell. All of our residents stay on the Wall Cornell campus of New York Presbyterian Hospital. We have resident housing, which is conveniently located right across the street from the hospital, and it is subsidized, so it's a lot less ex expensive than uh, housing on the New York City market. New York City is a really exciting place to live. Because the residents live close by, it's easy for us to get together for happy hours, dinner, shopping. We've even gone on skiing and paintballing trips. In New York City, we have a very diverse patient population and people come from all over to get their care here. So we have the opportunity to make diagnoses that we might not see at other institutions. As a resident at Cornell, you'll have access to all kinds of opportunities. The education is outstanding. The faculty are phenomenal and great mentors and the facilities are second to none. We've set up cutting edge research tools here that allow residents to do things that they won't be able to anywhere else. The residents here do very well in obtaining fellowships, both at this institution and at others. Exceptional faculty, teachers, and at the end of the day, I'm just really prepared to become a pathologist. There's really no better place for a young person to come to begin their pathology career.